Hi friend, if you are thinking to plan your vacation here to Puerto Vallarta and you're thinking to Las Animas Beach, Quimixto or Marietas, and if you're thinking to uh, take these tours on Catamaran to those places, this is your video. We're gonna talk about the good, the bad, and the ugly about this kind of tours, catamarans tours here in Puerto Vallarta. And I'm gonna give you a lot of information about this kind of tour. So, but before, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, activate all the notifications to get the latest news here in Puerto Vallarta, Nuevo Vallarta, and uh, information about activities, tours, and what to do here in Puerto Vallarta. Remember, follow me on my social networks. There is more information over there. I have all these uh, social networks, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, uh, Facebook, there is more contact over there, okay? And if you want to sponsor my work or sponsor me, click on the join button and to become a sponsor to my channel, okay? That helps me a lot, thank you. Okay, uh, talking about the good about uh, the catamaran tours here in Puerto Vallarta. First of all, uh, right now is the rainy season. Sometimes it's not a good idea, uh, so check the uh, forecast for the day you want to go to a tour. Uh, the bad thing about the catamaran tours, it's in, on, on the rainy season, could be the bad weather. So plan ahead, check your um, check all the forecast for one week. You can do that on Google or any website. Uh, just Google it about the weather here in Puerto Vallarta, or stay tuned within my channel there is more uh, comments or uh, in my uh, social network there is more information about the forecast almost every day almost every day not ev not every day but there is uh, if there is a hurricane warning something uh, something like that i will let you know about that okay so uh, the good about the the catamaran tour here in puerto yarta they are cheap yes it's about uh, or around uh, 16, uh, no, no, 60 US dollar per person. Yes, uh, that's in, uh, and, and it's like a 30, 35 US dollar uh, per, per children. And it's from age from five years old to 11 years old. Adults after uh, 12 years old. And uh, the, the good is, it's because uh, you, it, it includes, um, food, uh, uh, continental breakfast, the lunch, uh, open bar, and activities like snorkeling, paddleboard. And if you go to the south shore of Puerto Vallarta, that, that's mean uh, Los Arcos, that's a national park um, on, 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 on the south shore of Puerto Vallarta. And you can go to Las Animas Beach, that is amazing beach. Uh, there is one of my videos here of Las Animas. You can check my video here. Or go to Kimixto. There is a waterfall over there, okay? Uh, it's cheap and it's like um, the schedule is from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. And it's all like half day of activities. And and, and, and it's amazing, it's, it's very fun. During the trip, uh, it's party on the boat uh, and this open bar, okay? And you can do more activities uh, on the boat. If you want to stay on the boat, it's okay. Or uh, you can uh, disembark on Las Animas Beach or choose Kimixto. Uh, my recommendation is choose Kimixto. If it's your first time, choose Kimixto because there is a waterfall. And especially in this rainy season, the waterfall is more, with, with more water, obviously it's, it's nice, it's, it's, it's better, okay? That's the good thing about the catamaran tours. Let's talk about the bad things about the catamaran tours. The food, the food is not so great, uh, but it's okay. Uh, and you have like three meals to choose. Um, and I think there is uh, some fish or hamburger or uh, meat. And I think it's not very, very good food on the on the boat. You have included the lunch on the boat, but it's not the best. The another bad thing is the continental breakfast. It's only juice, some hotcakes, and some fruits, and that's it. That's it. It's and coffee, and 
It's very simple. It's very simple. My recommendation, my recommendation, um, if you're going to uh, Las Animas, uh, you can uh, take the lunch over there. But uh, normally in this kind of tours, they lead you uh, to, the, to their restaurants or the restaurants of the tour. Uh, sometimes, or I don't know, I've never tried to, to switch in, to another restaurant, but, I, but, but they, they normally tell you this is the restaurant you must go. Uh, this is the bad thing about the tours. And if you choose to go to Kimixto Waterfalls, normally um, the another like bad thing over there, it's like 40 minutes um, hiking uh, from the beach of Kimixto to the waterfalls. And if you are not like uh, in good shape or good, good condition, it's, it's, it's gonna be a little bit difficult. But over there you can rent an, a, a mule and you can do the, the trip on a mule. Um, the last time that I know the prices of a mule for renting a mule is 300 pesos, okay? Check that uh, as you arrive and talk with the, with the guys renting a mule and, um, and pay it directly. You, you, uh, normally the boat uh, don't have the mules. Normally it's the people from over there who has the mule and you can rent the mule to go to the waterfall of Kimixta. The another bad, bad thing about uh, uh, this, uh, this kind of tours, um, it's the lines for go to the bathroom on the boats. Could be large, uh, especially for the women. Could be one bathroom for women and one bathroom for the, the, the men. And could be a large line. So be aware of that. Let's talk about the ugly thing about catamaran tours here in Puerto Vallarta. Uh, if you choose to go to um, Marietas Island, the hiding, uh, the hiding beach, or La Isla del Amor, if you want to know with your, um, with, uh, with your couple, with your loved one, uh, and you want to enter, uh, you must to know there is some. Uh, uh, just a little space available for enter. So you must to um, book for advance to enter to that beach because it's a, a national park and it's protected for the government right now. So it's getting more difficult to get access to the hidden beach of, of, of Las Marietas Island, okay? So, and you need to pay uh, like 15, no, 50 or one uh, one thousand Mexican pesos more per person, and you must to um, you must to know to swim. If you swim, if you're a good swimmer, it's great. It's not for children. It's only for adults. Okay, be aware of that. Because if you buy your tickets and some people uh, sell you the tickets for everybody, even child. Could be a problem and there is no refund okay that is a scam okay check this out and this is the this is the the, the ugly part the other ugly part about catamaran tours and when i told you it's included open bar it's only when all the activities are done i mean you can drink beer or alcohol and then do an activity it, that's that's makes sense obviously You can't, you can't, you can't do that without, it's like driving and drinking, obviously you can do it. Or sometimes the catamarans, um, they decide not to open the bar until they come back, okay? And the salesman no, <laughs> don't tell you that the, the, the open bar is not available until they come back, okay? But if you say, I don't, I don't I'm, I'm not gonna do any activity, I just want, uh, I, I can take my alcohol or the drinks right now. And uh, it's better to have a wingman with you. If you uh, know you that you are not in control of the alcohol, please um, be aware of that and just don't drink alcohol, okay? It could be very dangerous, okay? 
Well, that's all the uh, information about Catamaran's tour, the good things, the bad things, and the ugly thing. What do you think about this information? Tell me in the comments if you want, uh, or if you need more information, I'm gonna give you more information. If you want to support me, I can sell you the tickets for this kind of tours, all the tours here in Puerto Vallarta. See you next time, bye-bye.